Welcome everybody and uh, this is a beautiful day to do some cleansing work today. I think a lot of us are going through a lot of stress right now with all the what ifs and, and all the madness that's happening outside of this room, this this reality, this, this uh, madhouse, this uh, clown show, this uh, lunatic asylum. Everything is inverted back to front, wrong way around, inside out. We know this. And what we're dealing with is a lot of um, ignorance, a lot of uh, hypnosis, a lot of um, voodoo spell, a lot of negativity all in this world. A lot of fighting, a lot of arguing, a lot of ego, a lot of pride, uh, a lot of fear. And in times of, of the overwhelming release that we need to we need to let go this release that that is vital. If not, then we'll blow, right? You shake a, a bottle and um, if you don't open it, it's just going to explode. It's that kind of feeling a lot of the times. And meditation is a wonderful thing for that. Meditation is a great way to just let it out, release it. Um, people have asked me what I do uh, when it becomes too overwhelming. Well, I have some music and um, that music I use is what's playing now. And it's for everybody to, to play, it's free. So if you just go to, if you just type in to YouTube, Mark Bayerski Music, you'll get a one hour or three or four hour um, music non-interrupted with adverts there might be an advert at the start or the no there's no adverts at all so basically this is how i would do it so i'll i'll just take i'll talk you through it and um and what i use so i like to cleanse my energy to begin with so the way i cleanse it is uh, this is my room so everything in here is what i use so I normally look around for what I need. So the first thing I would grab, if I'm doing this release of dark, heavy, dirty energy, the first thing I'd get is um, Agua de Florida. And I would use that as I have for 20 years. Always have a bottle with me. And uh, I squirt a little in my hand, rub my hands together and then breathe through my nose. <laughs> Again, <laughs> one more time. <laughs> well, to say it unblocks and sends all sorts of stuff going on, it does. It's quite powerful. And then what I'd do is go for my blessed water, sacred water, and I'd spray it all around and on top of me. That is cleansing my energy. So I feel lighter already in my head, which is great. That's a good sign. And then I would specifically go for an oil that is to cleanse, release cleanse. So I would go for my cleansing oil, which is here. I take the cleansing oil and I'd use about three drops. And what I do, this is what I do here if I'm sat down. I take, I take some and put on my temples, okay? I take a bit and put it on the back of my neck. Just rub on the back of my neck, like that. The most important thing when you're doing a, a self-cleansing, especially when it's heavy energy, is if you take it in both hands and go to the back where your kidneys are, you're rubbing at the back and then down to the base of your spine and back up again, all around there. And there's a reason for it because negative energy sits in the back. That's why many people have lower back pain and mid, mid back pain. When you've done that, you've still got the oil on your hand, okay? So breathe through the nose and blow out through the mouth about four or five times. Remember, you've got the music on. Uh, if you're asking me what healing oil, if you go to your local um, store and look for an oil called Paolo Santo, 
100% Paolo Santo oil. That is what you should be working with. Fabulous. If you get that and mix it with a base oil, brilliant. Okay. There's only one crystal that I ever work with when I'm doing deep cleansing of negative energy. If I'm getting rid of negative energy, the crystal is what I'm wearing. It's here. But when I'm doing this work on myself, this is what I use. I either use bombs or a couple of these or whatever shape, but they are tectites. These specific tectites, they're incredible. They're the only crystal that I believe in my understanding as a healer for these years that literally absorbs the negative energy when they're put near you. So I sleep with them under the pillow. I sleep with them around the bed. I wear them. I put them in my pocket. I've shown you before. I have uh, some in my pocket. Somebody asked me uh, if I would sell uh, uh, bags of it so that they could put it in their pocket and their, their bag and places like that in the house. I said, yeah, I'll do that. So what I'll do is maybe in the next coming days, I shall get a certain amount of them, put them into a bag and then let you know about that. But anyway, going back to these, this is how, how I would do it. So it's as simple as holding them and placing them down where you're comfortable so you are not in any kind of pain. You can lay down for this, okay? Just as easy. As long as these are in your hand. And now what we do is focus on the music. Now, Tektite is a natural crystal that does not need to be spoken to. It doesn't need to uh, have any kind of, you know, energy put into it. It's a natural absorber of negative energy. Once they're in your hand, the secret is to get into a, a meditative state of healing and release. So the only way you can release that is by forgiveness. So this point is where you have to forgive all that has happened today. Whoever's upset you, however you felt within yourself, forgive yourself, forgive everybody, let it go. By doing that, that energy will be then sent straight to the crystal. It will just naturally go. If you're holding on to the suffering and pain, it'll stay. It will stay. Right, so this is the way to do it. Hold. You, you might say to me now, but when you wear one, doesn't it cleanse? Look, I need to explain this carefully because tectite isn't an easy, an easy explanation, although it sounds easy. Any negative energy dispersed by you, within you and around you, if it's lingering, this crystal will absorb it naturally. But you can help this happening by meditating and letting go. So it's okay, I've let it go. And then it comes and then it gets sucked into the crystal. So try it now if you've got tectite. Breath is so important. Breathe through the nose and out of the mouth. Release my fears. Release my pain. Release my anger. Release my sorrow.
Breathe in through the nose for three seconds. Hold your breath for three seconds. Release the breath through the mouth for three seconds. Hold your breath for three seconds. And repeat. As you're doing this, you will start to feel an urge to move the crystals on your hand to a specific point of the body. If not, stay where you are. I have an urge to move the crystals to my stomach. And now I'm gonna hold the crystals against my stomach with my hands on the crystal and continue with the breathing. Repeat in the same mantra as I did at the beginning. In time you will find that the three seconds will turn to six, seven, eight, even ten. Go with that. My urge is to go around to the back now and continue. I actually can feel the tectites absorbing energy from within and around my body. It's actually incredible. If you feel your tectites getting hotter and hotter, that's a really good sign. If you also feel your crystal getting colder and colder, this is also a very powerful healing sign. Whenever you feel a pain in the body, quickly go with a crystal or two of them and place them right there. And then continue the breathing continue the healing the pain that you're getting is negativity pulling away from the physical and once that happens the pain will disappear and it will enter into the tectite naturally i have done this practice for 20 years and it has kept me sane healthy of mind body and spirit tectite is the most amazing crystal that the only one I have ever seen absorb negative energy and dispel it. There is no need to cleanse your tectite. It is self-cleansing. It is incredible. Yet some people like to put them out into the sun. Nothing wrong with that. 
or the moon if you feel that energy whatever whatever suits you bury them also wonderful but for me they're self-cleansing one thing i would like to say is that when you are strong and fit and healthy and you feel amazing grab your tectites and give energy back into your tectites that is something that i always do with my crystals five ten minutes is ample these are on fire now these are on fire i wish you could feel them they're on fire that is a great sign of healing taking place and the crystal absorbing it's brilliant and that's it it's very very much a simple five ten minutes and i promise you you will feel better i wear tech tight through the day i wear it with herkimer diamond and moldavite it's a perfect combination for me um, i'm always working with the most beautiful tech tights i can so over here are a few of my tech tights that i'm working on now and over there there's some tech tights that i'm working on um, and uh, I guess that's it that was a little workshop please give it a try please remember the music a couple of beautiful pieces of tech tie in both hands and work your magic it is the most powerful crystal absorbing cleansing ceremony little ritual that you can do on yourself whenever you feel negative whenever you feel overwhelmed whenever it's just too much just do this and i promise you you won't go wrong you will find yourself feeling better moments after minutes after and then 10 15 minutes you'll feel great if you really want to do a really special cleanse then first start before you do anything and cleanse yourself with sage if you don't know how to do that go to this channel and you will see the number two video number one video of the most watched videos out of my 1500 videos is the lemons after the lemons it shows you how to cleanse with sage you burn sage you use the smoke to cleanse yourself so that's how i would do it i hope this video serves you well i hope you enjoyed it any questions please ask below and i'll do my best to scan through in these next coming days and that's it what i'm going to do now um, is i selected about 1500 tectides some small ones and i'm going to work out how many i can put in a single bag 
and then I will put them on my website and you can use them for your pockets. You can use them exactly like I have right now. You can use them in that way, put a few in one hand, a few in the other. And when you finish with them, put them into your pocket, put them into your purse, keep them close to you, any uh, jacket pockets, um, and you'll find that it makes a massive difference through the day if you're working with the general public. If you're dealing with people who are of very negative energy, um, you'll find it helps. It really helps. I mean that from the bottom of my heart. 20 years I've been doing this work and Tech Tight has always been my number one for absorbing negative energy. Hope this serves you well. Thank you for going to markbayeski.com and buying your authentic, genuine Tech Tights and all the other crystals and oils and incense and sage and teas. Thanks guys, I really appreciate it. We've been doing really good this week and we've had all your orders wrapped and packed this afternoon so we've caught up. So expect your beautiful spiritual tools very soon. Okay guys, I'm gonna get back to work, a lot to do. <laughs>